Welcome from Lignas Wanderers. This is Robert here, and I wanted to give a little bit of an update about uh, upcoming content on this channel in the next few weeks, because next week the beta is going to start. Um, but like I said a couple of videos before, I will not participate in the beta. I want uh, 3.0 to be finished and then experience it. The Basically, as soon as the beta, um, as soon as 3.0 comes out, I just want to lock myself into this room and um, like enjoy, t turn back, back on the PUE game music, which I haven't done for ages and experience like everything, the whole story with the dialogue and like fully immerse myself into the story because it's probably just this one time that I'm going to experience it and because I don't know, don't want to spoil anything for myself I am just going to not visit reddit for like six weeks it's going to be super hard not watch any podcasts or um, like any Path of Exile YouTube content which is also super hard because I really enjoy doing that and yeah I, I reckon um, I'm gonna be either playing more in Legacy League or maybe check out a few other games. Uh, recently I uh, I purchased Everspace on Steam which is a really nice roguelike action RPG in space you can say. Uh, it looks really really cool, it plays really really cool. Um, I also started a NEK character recently. What the hell is that? Never had that prophecy. Um, yeah, shut up. Um, I, I started an EK character with the sh uh, chevrons that I had, did a little bit of low-life uh, EK Nova shenanigans, which was fun for a while. Uh, I think that char character made it, it's like level 82 at the moment. Um, but was going super fast. But one thing that bothered me about this one that at some point it just went too fast for my taste. It's, it's, it's kind of weird saying that. So that, that basically again proves that I'm not the most efficient player or like a pro player in general, which I don't mind at all because I am playing this game just for fun. And I'm making something like 200 million XP per hour. like just cutting everything to pieces. Um, went into red maps, uh, still mowed down everything. Had a couple of problems with bosses here and there because EK is not the, the best single target skill, obviously. But overall, um, had had no problems at all with the content in general. And just mowed through everything and for some reason that stopped being fun after after some time. I think I'm actually more I'm 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 leaning when it comes to fun I'm leaning toward towards uh, more towards the slow playstyle. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Even though it's it's inefficient and everything, but uh, for me personally, I'm missing one glyph. It's more fun. Yeah, and after that, I basically started this uh, summoner here because I never ever played a summoner. And this way I also managed to uh, finally play all three Witch Ascendancies because the, the Firestormer was the Elementalist, the EK character was the Occultist, and um, this of course now is a Necromancer. And I'm, I'm enjoying it, I mean I'm, I'm, I'm just leveling. Um, Let's see how it is in maps, but of course, like we all know that summoners are pretty well rounded, pretty strong in general, and yeah, it's like leveling wise, it's a lot of fun. Looking forward to how mapping is. Also, uh, I did this video like right before this one last week, I think it was about energy shield and life, which was a massive fail. Uh, I did it. Tempest. I did it because I was like super triggered by Reddit again after people complaining so much about volatiles and 
guess the video that I made was not well made. It was totally rushed. It was not a fair comparison at all. I totally admit that. And what uh, people have been pointing out in the video comments and also on the Reddit thread is, yeah, the actual problem is not physical damage, which I was uh, demonstrating in that video, but elemental damage. But then again, for some reason, I mean, I, I leveled the Firestormer until level 95. And I did pretty much, as soon as I hit level 90, the remaining five levels, I just elked and go. So, and I did that with tier 11 to tier 16 maps, without any exceptions. And the only time I, 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 I re-rolled a map using a Chaos Orb was basically when the map had element, Elemental Reflect, which was the only map mod that character couldn't run. So yes, I ran, I ran double alley damage crit maps, and guess what? I, I also survived. If you play carefully, then you don't fucking die. I, I can see how if you are doing the clear speed meta thing and you want to play like efficiently, and if you want to compete, then it's bullshit. Then, then yeah, then you're just going so fast. And eventually, you, you're gonna get wrecked because you run into a room full of spark mages and a try alley damage map. And then, but that's again your own fault if you just run in there head first, just because you're used to that um, to that high speed and whatever. But with with my playstyle, and I'm wondering how many people are just playing the game as I am, like for fun. Uh, not for efficiency, trying trying fun content, trying to basically challenge themselves, running maps that are actually hard, but still like completable. If it doesn't, I mean, obviously, if it takes like 20 minutes to complete a map, that's also, that that's a waste of time. But if it takes, I don't know, seven minutes instead of four, yeah, you could run another map, so for min-maxing it's terrible, but if I'm enjoying it, if I'm enjoying the challenge, and if it's like somewhat rewarding in terms of, hey, my, my character actually managed to pull that off without dying, then, I don't know, for me, for me that's, that's, that's all it takes, so I, I enjoy it that way. And I'm, I'm really looking forward to 3.0 and the changes 3.0 brings. Um, and see see what nasty things GDG will throw at us in Acts uh, 5 to 10, and then also in maps, whatever they, they upgrade there. It's gonna it's gonna, gonna be cool. I'm really, really looking forward to this. Which is obviously in about, I guess, five to six weeks, six to seven, who knows. If I'm not gonna make another video until then, I wish you an awesome summer. If I do, then, well, see you next time. This is Robert, and I hope to see you in game.